Okay, so I tried drawing a profile picture and uh, it went okay. <laughs> Hey gamers, welcome back to the first episode of How To Skyblock. And I'm gonna teach you how to get unlimited amount of chain armor. I'm gonna sneeze now. Achoo! Okay, uh, it was it was there, it was there, I swear to god. It's like right, okay, I don't know, it, it's, it's gone now. Hey! <laughs> I know a lot of you guys don't know, I, I didn't even know until late last season on how people kept getting like chain armor. I thought you only can get it through like really rare drops from fishing. I thought that was the only way, but there's an easier way and it's so much better. And let me show you how. Okay, first thing you need is a splash potion of weakness. To make that, you need some glass bottles and to make awkward potions, you just put one nether ward in there. A fermented spider eye. So to make that, you need sugar, spider eye, and a mushroom. And do this, like that, like this, you get a fermented spider eye. Put that in and it'll start cooking again and that will turn it into a potion of weakness. Obviously, you don't want to be drinking, you want to be throwing it. So you got to put a gum powder in there to turn that into a splash potion so you can actually throw it. You put that in and you're ready to go. Also, you need a golden apple. I'm pretty sure you spawn in the first time you join a server, you spawn in with a golden apple. But if you don't and you manage to throw it out or you just ate it all, just cut down some oak trees for the gold, just kill some zombie pigmen and you're good to go. So the last thing you need is a zombie spawner. You need a zombie spawner for yourself because if you do it on somebody else's island, well, you don't get to keep it because it's not on your island, <laughs> you dumbass. All right, so you gotta get your own. Um, they're not even too expensive. I'm pretty sure zombie spawners are just pretty shit at the moment. It's 185k. Oh, no, 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 wait. I'm looking at the wrong one. It's 60k. <laughs> it's 60k for a zombie spawner because it's not meta right now. Look, look what it drops. It's it's so shit. <laughs> so what you want to do is you got to find like an enclosed area. The reason why is because people can kill your villager. If you have your island open, people can come over and kill your villager. And that's going to be super annoying because getting a villager is, well, you got to be quite lucky to get one. It's 60k in shop, but if you go to auction house slash R, Swaggle here is selling his zombie spawner for 40 grand. You only need one, but I have two because I open a bunch of myth keys and... Unfortunately, I got zombie spawners. If you do have two, if you have multiple, you want to put it separately so it spawns in two stacks. What you need to do, this all depends on luck, okay? It all depends on luck. So all you have to do is you got to wait for a zombie villager to spawn. And essentially, yeah, essentially you want to cure it using the splash potion of weakness and a golden apple. What you want to do is throw the splash potion of weakness on and then right click it with a golden apple and it will turn into back to a villager. But here's the catch, if you want chainmail armor. You gotta be lucky enough that that villager is a blacksmith villager. If it's not a blacksmith villager, um, it will just give you like normal trades, but it's still pretty good. I know you guys are going like, oh, it's not worth it because you're only gonna have it for like, what, four minutes, three minutes. First thing, it's gonna stay on your island forever until you kill it. So clear lag doesn't remove it, okay? You're, you're good with that, okay? Okay, here it is. So it looks super weird, okay? It looks unrendered for me. So you throw the thingy and then you right click it. And then boom, you got a villager. So you want to have a blacksmith villager. It's basically the villager that trades chain armor. Okay, what does a blacksmith villager look like? Wait, images. What's this? What? <laughs> Okay, future Saboru here. I just realized that the blacksmith villager has a black turban. A black, no, no, not a turban. Black apron. You know, yeah, look for the black apron. Okay, as you can see, just all ground items cleared, but these guys are still here. Dude, this sucks. 10, 10 emeralds for an unbreaking one tunic? Are you dumb? What? Ooh, where are you going? Wait, no, no, it's a dumb trade. Yeah, you walk away. I'm, I'm so tempted to kill you right now. Look at me when I'm talking to you. Oi, look at, look at me. But, hey, what was that? I'm gonna trade with him. Don't make me trade with him. I will trade with him. Yeah. What'd you say? What you say? Say it again. Say it. Say it. Say it. Say it. Say it. Yeah, shut up. Uh. Okay. You guys talking shit? Hey! Social distancing! Jesus Christ! Hey! I swear to God, you are pissing me off, squidward looking fuck. 
You know what? You don't you don't get to see the world. You you piece of shit. You never get to see the world again. Uh, all black. Oh, it's the armor. You know how many times? You know, you have no idea how long I've been looking for you. Oh, you've been looking for me too? Hey. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Okay, well, well, I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm gonna get you the cold that you need and, okay. No, I'm gonna get you the cold, don't worry. Just, just wait for me a bit, okay? Wait for me. Well, what do you mean? I mean, where, where else are you gonna go? Okay. I'm actually talking to a fucking NPC. What's wrong with me? Let's go here. I do that. I want iron. Don't want that either. Okay, we got chain armor. Chain boots. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you get chain armor. Are you? Are you human trafficking in Minecraft? Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching until the end of the video. Goodbye for now, and as always, take care. <laughs>